My first guest today comes from Boynton Beach. Bob Days has a passion for developing the current and next generation of leaders and influencers in our community. He is also passionate about helping people in the area of personal growth and development through teaching, coaching, and speaking. Bob is a native of North Carolina. He moved from North Carolina to the Bloomington, Indiana, Indiana area 17 years ago and then moved to the Boynton Beach area just over two years ago. For the past 30 years, he has been in sales, sales management, and sales training. He was formerly with Amtrust Financial Services in their extended service contract division, teaching and training clients on how to offer extended service contracts to their customers. Some of his clients included Brandsmart USA, Camping World, and West Marine. This past year, Bob received his certification with the John Maxwell team. John Maxwell has been named the number one leadership authority for the past five years by Amazon.com. He is the author of 74 books with 22 million copies sold. One of his books, The 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership, is known as the Leadership Bible. John is also a personal mentor and business partner to Bob. With his certification, Bob is able to speak, teach, and coach on programs that were designed by the John Maxwell team for the development of leadership and personal growth on an individual and corporate level. Bob's company, Bob Dave's Associates, offers a range of personal and leadership development services for individuals and companies to include mastermind groups, individual or team or group coaching, workshop seminars, and keynote speaking. Bob is also active in the Chamber of Commerce of the Palm Beaches and the Bloomington Chamber of Commerce. Thanks for being with me, Bob. Thank you, Barry. I appreciate the opportunity. So how did you get involved in the area of leadership development and personal growth? Well, it started a long time ago. Back in my early 20s, uh, I'm a veteran of the United States Air Force. And the one thing the military will teach you, they will teach you leadership and management at the highest levels. They're always encouraging you. So that's kind of how I got started on, uh, on the leadership area. And then in my mid-20s, I became involved with a multi-level marketing company. And I started, they were teaching me that you've got to grow from the inside out. So I started going to a lot of seminars and, and things like that. So that's how I kind of got started on my journey. Who are some of the people that have uh, influenced you uh, when it comes to leadership? Well, uh, there's a myriad of them, and, and some of them have gone on to their, their own reward. Uh, probably one of the first ones was the late Zig Ziglar. Oh, yeah. Uh, Zig I know taught that. me something that has really impacted uh, through all my life. He said, you can have everything in life you want if you help enough other people get what they want. And that had a big impact. That changed my whole mindset when it comes to leadership and personal growth. Because over the years in sales and sales management and sales training, I've learned that if you put the other person first and you really work hard for them, the rewards will come to you. Uh, Jim Rome is another one. Jim's also gone on to his reward. And the biggest impact Jim ever had on my life was, he says, if you've been doing the same thing over and over and over again wrong, stop. <laughs> so, so, you know, he had a big impact. There's been Brian Tracy and Tom Hopkins and uh, John, uh, John Maxwell uh, has had a tremendous impact. Bob Berg, too. Bob Berg, yes. Good friend. Uh, is a good friend of John's, and he's he's had a lot of influence over the years so it's it's been a lot of mentors you know both personally professionally in their books audio tapes one of the things that that probably helped me more and if you're out there and you're trying to get on to the personal growth development and you listen to the radio on your way to work stop zig taught me this years ago he said you need to be in the rolling university and back then, cassette tapes, it'll date Put me. a CD in. Put a CD in and learn something. That's right. As you go, instead of listening to the bad news, <laughs> I, uh, with the advent of Facebook and social media, if there's anything bad going on, I'll see it on Facebook. That's right. So, so why do you want to help people when it comes to helping people in the area of personal growth and leadership development? The reason I want to help 
people, if, if you see things going on right now, there's a tremendous leadership vacuum, not only in corporate America, but in our government and other areas. And one of the areas, I, I've talked to a lot of human resource managers, and human resource managers have told me, you know, Bob, I can find a good manager. He's, managers are easy to find, but I can't find a great leader. And that brings me to the adage is, leaders are great managers, but managers are not always great leaders. So I want to help them in that area to develop those skills. What do you do to help people develop their leadership skills? We do it in a myriad of ways uh, through the John Maxwell program and, and through things that I've learned. One is what we call a mastermind group or a round table where we get people of like mind together and we will study one of the learning systems. One of the primary first learning systems I take everyone through is John's book, The 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership. It's a leadership Bible. If you start at law one and go through the law of the lid, which says you will never rise higher than your ability and lid of leadership, to all the way to law 21, which is the law of legacy, which is how will you be carried on after you're gone. So we start that, and we do those totally free. We just get people in there, like-minded people, you get to develop as a team because you exchange ideas what you believe each law means to you. When do you see people needing to develop their leadership skills? If I had my way about it, we would start them in kindergarten. <laughs> <laughs> Truly, because if, if you see people this day and age, there is not a lot of leaders out there. They're managers, they know how to, I tell people, here's, here's the difference between a leader and a manager. A manager is the guy that walks you come in the door every morning, sees when you get up to go get a cup of coffee, sees when you go to the bathroom, sees what time you leave in the afternoon. A leader in an organization, even if it's a large organization, will, cast a will take the vision of the company, bring it down to their department level, create a team of people to carry out that vision and all work to the common good of everyone within the organization. So where if people are interested, can you start helping them? Well, it's as simple as you can send me an email, bob at bobdavesassociates.com. I'll let you know when the next mastermind group is starting. Or you can call me at area code 561-740-7404. And, and I, I, I do return my phone calls. I don't put everybody into voicemail and, and deal. Deal with it. You can go to my website, www.bobdavesassociate.com, and that will give you some more information on, on the ways well, It's a pleasure having you on the show, and I wish you good luck. All right. Thank you, Barry. And we'll be right back. <laughs>